ice fishing is something that many look forward to every year. But to make sure that we're staying safe while out on that ice, we join the Valley Today's Abby Furchner live in Detroit Lakes with more. Good morning, Abby. Good morning, you guys. I'm outside the Quality Bait and Tackle shop here in Detroit, Wa Detroit Lakes with Becker County Sheriff Todd Glander. And so I just want to ask, you know, the first general advice you have for those ice fishers who are going to head out to the ice either this week or this weekend. Uh, first of all, know the lake that you're going to fish on. Uh, know where the outlets are, the inlets. Mm -hmm. And if you don't know, uh, you know, talk to the local bait shops, sports shops, and the local fishermen or, you know, whoever's out there and find out what, you know, if there's an area to stay away from, uh, what to look for yeah. and that kind of stuff. And let, let somebody know where you're going and, and when you're going to be back. And so what happens if you do end up falling through the ice? Uh, try to remain calm, even though that's going to be very difficult to do. Uh, but try to remain calm. Uh, kick, kick your feet so you can try to stay or get back up on the ice. And it's, uh, it's important to carry picks or something, use whatever is handy, keys, a uh, screwdriver, anything that can help you get back up on top of the ice. And then we do have your guys' boat behind us because you have to, you've had to do a rescue before. So if you're in an event where you do fall through the ice, you are able to reach people. That's correct. Uh, we train on the airboat along with our local fire departments and rescue squads. And it's something that we have, but we'd rather not use. Yeah. So, but we want to be prepared and we are prepared for situations like that. Absolutely. So these are just a few things that you'll want to remember before going out to the ice. Stay calm if you do end up falling through the ice, but just make sure you know what lake you're on and where you're going. Yeah, good, good advice this morning. Abby Furchner reporting live. Thank you.